Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. This is Game God Fluent, bringing you episode 17 of Let's Play Lawless Lands. Um, I have not played since April 14th, and today is June 6th. So we have not played in a while. But uh, excited to get back into it. Um, wait a minute. Here we go. Um, let's see, is it this file? We're at the Lone Cottage. Uh, we lost some... Um, we lost some uh, progress last time. So, uh, let's see. We have to go back and get Rorvik back. Pretty sure. It's my mouse. Cool music. Um. Are we over encumbered or something? Why are we moving so slow? Oh, do we have Rorvik? We do. Okay, Rorvik is part of the party. Um, oh, we're over 281 of 270. Okay. Um, Blackfish. Did we ever explore this town? I'm not sure. Gambler and Jeggy. Welcome to the Blackfish Traveler. How can I help you today? Who are you? People call me Jeggy. I'm the owner of the Blackfish. It isn't much, but it's a nice little tavern for folks to relax. I used to travel the land settling different brews that I had made, but I chose to settle down. What is this place? This is the Blackfish. It's my tavern. We don't get too many new faces around here. This is a nice change. It's usually the same few people who come in here. Stay out of trouble and there won't be any issues. Okay. Let's um try to find a place to sell. Feeling a bit under the weather. Rumors? Bulletin boards are a great way to find out what's going on in this settlement. Hovel. Warehouse. Well. Peasant. Tongue weed. Fishing spot, shrine, whoop. The shrine shimmers when light falls upon it. It hums softly with unseen energy from some unknown divine source. Pray to Ashantara, your prayer is ignored. Hmm. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Fishing hut. Wenlig. Oi, good day. Who are you? My name is Wenlig. I'm a fisherman. I've been fishing in these parts for just about as long as I've been alive. Never been out of the village, neither. It's been a little crazy out there, though. The lizard folk are getting more restless as time goes by. Need anything? Ah, uh, well, there is one thing. The fishermen in the village are having a hard time getting their fish. Those lizard can are getting bolder by the day. They keep coming closer to the village and scaring the fish away. Scaring the heck out of us. Some men decided to try to go after them and haven't been heard from ever since. There's a lair near the lake that they live in and use as a spawning ground. We think the men were killed, but there's a chance that they still may be alive. I can check it out. There were four of them that went looking for the lair. We think that the lair is on the other side of the lake, but it's very likely to be right along the water. When you get there, it might also be a good idea to kill some of those darn lizards. If you destroy their egg clutches, I'll figure out an extra reward for you. Just remember, the main thing you need to do is go and find those men. They were good men, and they might be in trouble. I hope that's not the case, though. Well, um, show me what you sell. Okay. Oh, we can't sell here? You sell different things, but I can't sell. An underwater coral. 
that resembles the spine and full rib cage. It smells bad like dung, and it's unique. I don't understand the unique part, but... <sighs> Alright. Sorry, I have things to do. Rumors. Istria province has dealt with rebellion for ages. Corsair. Ahoy there. I really need to get rid of some stuff. Jail. Alright, let's just junk some stuff here. Let's junk the truncheon. Um. Why aren't we wearing the carrying coat? Go ahead and oh, that takes our armor weight down. Ah, I didn't mean to optimize. No way, use iron will. Um, Felicia, you can afford to go down a little bit, I guess. Now can we move? There, now we're moving pretty fast. Is there an... Okay, F5 does that. Um... Let's go ahead and... Save. And, uh... I guess get out of here. Go find this <clears throat> lizardman lair if we can handle it. On the other side of the lake, outlaw hideout. Abandoned shack. Ton weed. Nice stash. Found seven scrap. Sunbud. Um. Take the hourglass and the bandage. Don't want the tainted food. Small mirror. Blanket, I guess. Leave the egg and the tainted food. Bedding. This bedding can be slept in. Cave shroom. Fireplace hasn't been used in a long time. So just a cheap place to sleep. But where is the lair? Over here somewhere? Fumo. Oh, on the other side of the lake. That would be around this way. Let's 
discovered Lake Lair. I don't know if we can handle um, Lizard Man, but I guess it's worth a shot. Hope you guys are doing well and want to see more Lawless Lands. Cyril is now ranked 2. Egg Clutch. Can be squashed and destroyed. Destroy it. Resource gear and incense. Covers 10% spirit for everybody. That's pretty nifty. See all those bone chimes? They're for warning intruders. I saw something like this years ago in a cave that I had to venture inside. There were booby traps too. We should be careful up ahead. Stay vigilant. A tome. Textbook written by a scholar of great knowledge. Use this to gain 100 XP on a selected character. Nice. The skeleton looks surprisingly fresh. The bones still have some fresh meat on them. This must be the body of one of the fishermen from the village. Let me go ahead and... Wow, we have plenty of MP to use. Let's go ahead and use this tome. If we can find it. Tome. Let's go ahead and use that on uh, Rorvik. And now let's go ahead and do some leveling up. Felicia has three. Okay. Let's um, look at talents. Immune to dread, makes blocking more effective. Effectively dodge critical strikes. Dodge ranged magic attacks. Effectively dodge melee to be more accurate. We have that. Effectively evade threats such as traps. Kill more effortlessly. Allows learner to counterattack. Effectively treat wounds. Hmm. She has accuracy too. She has relentless resistance to stun. She has Vigor, Fueled Rage, 5% action points gained. Hmm. She has Mend. Stone skin smite. Siphon. Divine energy guides the target. Scorch, 9 to 21, plus power damage, burning 1 to 3 torrent turns. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and learn Scorch. And then let's get a passive.
Makes us learn a harder to route and have more spirit. Let's go with Fueled Rage. Allows you to gain action points quicker. 5% action points gained. I like that. Again, I'm not building these characters to be like min-maxed. I'm just doing it on a whim, basically. Almeric the Paladin. He's got Spellcraft. Trait Formidable. And Intensity 1. Punch, Kick, Assist, Field Prayer. A prayer for the company. 60% chance to remove each curse, disease, rotting, blinded, poison. Signature skill. Interesting. And he is a paladin. So. Um. Just lighting a cigarette here. Um. He has exalt. Let's go ahead and learn skills. Um. Spells. I wouldn't mind him learning Smite. Um. Just use it to save unused action points. Independence. Oh, he's got independence. He acts independently in combat. Okay. Make him unwavering, maybe. Fast to master, 5% XP. Yeah, let's get that. <sighs> and maybe intensity too. Go along with how he's already intense. Um, Tarwin. Sever Sunder. Dirty Trick. Elusive, evasive, fast to react, dispersion, slasher, quick reflexes, um, faultless con concentration. How about elusive three? Dodge criticals or evasive. Yeah, let's go with evasive three. Then let's go let's do Cyril the Thug. He's got whack and smash. Trait deceiver. Characters deceiving 5% high rate, 5% confused attack chance trait. Pacifies his signature skill. Requires bludgeon plus 15 and init plus 85% confused chance. <clears throat> Alright, let's learn skills. He's independent too. Him an enforcer, panic detect. Let's uh, I have not come across. You know what? Let's go ahead and give him firearms proficiency. I've not come across firearms yet, but uh, it's good to have somebody who can use them. And then all that's left is oh, Ursula. Ok, 
2% vigor regeneration. Undying. Like wound, heal it slightly. Provoke. Trips the opponent with trip. 35% stun chance. Yes, let's get trip. And then get the one that. Paralyzed, get the one that does stunned. Bruiser. And... <clears throat> um... I guess Lick Wound. I've got 10. I've got a lot of stuff. Cold snap. What's that? Resistance to the effects of harsh weather. Alright, let's learn some skills here. Borderlander. Move at full speed through tough terrain like water and bushes. Siphon, 48 plus power damage. Let's learn Siphon. Um, we need some HP. No longer lose additional supplies in the heat. We are going to be Getting to the heat. Let's get vitality, 10% vigor. 20% vigor. Um. Damage defiant. about floor traps again sure um 3 MP left six to ten we already have scorch Silence one to three. Let's get mute. Hmm. And, um, hard axe, hard bludgeon. Go with accuracy one and <laughs> bruiser, five percent stun attack chance. I think that's pretty good. All right. Go ahead and use our prayer book. found one of the missing four fishermen. It's not a clutch. More root. Gap. There's a gap in the wall that looks like it leads into another small cavity. Yeah, sure. Uh-oh. Oh, just one. There's your kin foot pad. 
Blinded. Still blinded. Um, let's go ahead and scorch it. And you... Impale. shield and a lock pick <sighs> rocks wooden spoon and we'll take the wooden spoon just in case rag silver dust and hourglass I guess oh now we're over encumbered here we've got to store some stuff we already have a wooden spoon um, we have six hourglasses. Let's put two here. Squash them. Loose Lord. Resource gear. Bread. <coughs> Don't need the knife. Shroom. Okay, just one. So let's go ahead and scorch it. And a lizard can ravager. Oh no. Right, let's just fight it and fight it. Should die here. It's enraged. and a sea spine. Nothing in there. Rock. The rock is too heavy to move. Crevice leads down into another part of the cave. Sure. Body. Supposed to be one of the fishermen. He's dead from a stab wound in his belly. Let's go ahead and save while we're here. Never know when we're going to run into a whole bunch of them. A clutch. Herbal tonic. Nice. Rope can be used to bring the boat back here. Can still float. Use boat. Can see there's three other landings across the water, but cannot make out any details due to how dark it is in here. Let's go to the west landing. Crate with lockpick. Wolf pelt and uh, blanket. Let's store. Um, uh, oh, geez. What do we store? Small mirror. A straw doll. Allow you to save anytime you wish a blank book. Just drop one of those. Drop a goblet. Oh. What the heck are these? 
Bat swarms. Hmm. Dang. Dang. Okay. You can take him out, okay. She's about to level up. Cave Shroom. Bet that's a good fishing spot. Um. Go ahead and save again. Southwest landing. Rope and going down further. Southeast landing. It's a pretty cool little dungeon. Just push the A clutch and a stash. I found one ration. Southwest landing. from a ceiling into a hole in the floor. Cave shroom. down there further, so let's head up this way. Body. Must be one of the fishermen. Looked like he was clubbed to death. And an empty sack. Just about done with our quest. Oh dear. This is real bad. Lizard King Darter. Impale. Darter. This is almost surely an instant death. Especially wearing the carrying coat. Uh, scorch. She's all kind of paralyzed and stuff. Just getting rocked. Flight failed. Wow. Um, we can try to scorch again and smite a foot pad. Self. Oh, I didn't want that. I just wanted to die. Wow. 
Wow. I'm not gonna save that. Let's return to title screen. I saved back here. One well, materials. We may get to the boss or whatever of this place and, and it be too hard for us. I guess. We should go ahead and have Felicia mend us. <sighs> Let's use this prayer book off in here. To a random encounter, it's probably all but over. But if we keep sticking to how we're doing, ah, we might be okay. Let's see how long we've been playing. F5. Here we go. 37 minutes. Okay, we could play a few more minutes. This game just recently got an update. Just the other day. Oh no. No! Flight. Let's just flight it away. Close it net. As you approach the grotto, you notice there are a group of lizard folk inside. One of them looks like a shaman. Hmm. Oh dear. Okay, this might be doable. Grick. Let's scorch the ravager. Let's scorch the ravager. Cast fade is faded. should burn to death. Let's scorch the foot pad. Scorch the foot pad. Oof. We may be able to do this. Let's scorch Grick. You scorch the foot pad. Warded. We can silence Grick. Mute him. We scorch him. Failed. Trained. He's warded. Mash and impale. She's panicked. Try to mute him again and scorch him. 
failed. He doesn't bust out anything too crazy. Um, shield bash. I have to check that shard. Uh, tard shield too. He's almost dead. Hmm, that drain didn't help. Minus faded. Scorch and fight. Okay, you do a specific smash and you do impale. No! Okay, lost at six. Ooh, lost nine. Smash and fight. Almost got him. No! Smash and fight. Yes. First. Smash and impale. Nice. Critical. Ooh. Scorch. Got him. Ooh. Victory. Felicia ranked up. Felicia scavenging. Lord. Five fame. Two rags. A lizardkin fetish. An herbal elixir. Herbal tonic. And rations. Let us quickly. Quickly save. We're over encumbered. Rations, rugged gloves. Let's store um, two hourglasses, a wooden spoon, 19 rags. Let's go five rags. Egg, cheese, materials. We'll take the materials. Ah, we'll take the cheese, too. And the egg. Go ahead and eat some of that soon. We're at 11 supplies. Um, we'll check what's in the hollow next time. Let's go ahead and eat a cheese. Um... Discard the tainted food. Let's go ahead and have some fruit. Uh, can we make herbed fish? Yeah, we can make herbed fish. 
ahead and eat some herb fish. Up to 32% supplies. Yeah, we'll find out what's in here next time. I want to thank you guys for joining me. Hope you enjoyed more Lawless Lands. Much more to come because I'm going to get back into this one a bit and record more. So I want to thank you guys for joining. Thank you so much. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. And uh, stay tuned for more. Much love, peace, and joy to you guys. Take care. And I'll see you again next time with more Lawless Land. So long. <laughs>